There are occasions where a company may decide to provide gifts or rewards to uh, people who are not their employees. Um, the tax award scheme is a mechanism whereby the gift provider can account for any tax or national insurance due in such circumstances. Now, if it was an employer providing incentives to their own staff, they can use the tried and tested pays you and settlement agreement route, but this avenue is denied um, in this circumstance. To enter into a tax award scheme, the gift provider must contact HMRC and enter into an agreement of the types of gifts that they wish to provide uh, and also an agreement of the amount of tax and national insurance that they will pay on behalf of the recipient. Then after the end of the tax year, uh, the gift provider sh has to make a return to HMRC of who's received uh, what, the amount of the, any particular incentive that's been given to them, and the amount of tax and national insurance that has been paid on their behalf. Similarly, uh, the recipient also needs a statement, a certificate from the gift provider uh, showing them the total amount of the award that they've uh, in receipt of and also the amount of tax that's been paid on the behalf. In most instances, that uh, if the employee happens to be a 20% taxpayer, there's no further action to be taken. However, if they are a higher rate taxpayer, then they need this information to be able to complete their self-assessment tax return. If you require any more information about this subject or any other employment tax related matter, please do not hesitate to contact us. And before we go, we, you may be interested to find out more about uh, different areas that HMRC can delve into the next time they visit you. So to do so, please click on the banner above and register for our free webinar on how to keep safe from HMRC.